Hello everybody, my name is Robin. I am Katahdin Cooking Mama's Homestead and I'm making Eggs Benedict. But I'm just gonna show you how to make the best hollandaise sauce. So let's get started. First, we wanna take this butter and we wanna cut it. We wanna cube it. So what I do is I just cube. You want it small because hollandaise sauce takes a, a while and you have to cook it on a low heat. I have done hollandaise sauce before. This time I'm adding a little bit of canine pepper because on the best recipe online, it shows adding a little bit of canine pepper. I have never added it before. I do like it the regular way, but I'm gonna do it for the best hollandaise sauce. If it's two people, it's four eggs and so on. Two eggs per person, but to make the hollandaise sauce, you only need three eggs and you're not using the white you can save them for an egg white omelet you can make them for a frittata you can throw in anything do not waste them food is so expensive make meringue cookies do something with them okay i got my butter all cubed i'm gonna wipe my hands i'm gonna divide the egg yolks i get a separate bowl for that and I take an egg and I crack it and I divide my white between my yolk and I get all that off and I put that right in there and I'm keeping my shells I cook my shells and I make calcium powder and it's good for tablets. It's good for your plants if you make a fertilizer with it, or you can feed them back to your chickens. So there's no waste with the shells either. You need three egg yolks. <laughs> okay, you need three tablespoons of lemon juice. So I'm gonna get another bowl because I don't have enough lemon juice, so I'm gonna squeeze some fresh. I prefer the lemon juice that comes in a container. It's got more of a flavor. But we're going to see what we got because we're using stuff up. So I want to see what you can see. So that's not even a half a teaspoon. You need three tablespoons of lemon juice. You're gonna melt it on low. So I'm turning it between five and three. I'm gonna add my lemon juice to it. And I'm gonna whisk that. I'm gonna bring you closer so you can see what's going on. I'm gonna add some more of my butter. half again and I'm gonna add my egg yolks you want to cook them on low because you don't want scrambled eggs And please don't walk away from the pan. This is a process that needs it to be cooked constantly by stirring. See how that butter is almost melted already? You're going to add some more of your butter. I'm doing another half. So I got a quarter left 
of my butter. See how it's nice bright orange? That's what you want. See how that's almost cooked? You wanna add the rest of your butter. See how the sauce is not scrambled? It's just the sauce. You just keep stirring. And it will start to thicken up really quick. Now I'm gonna add just a sprinkle or a pinch of canine. I didn't put too much, just a sprinkle. turn my heat down to an even low heat because it's starting to get thick. So your sauce is thickened up. You see that? Your sauce is ready right about now. So what I'm going to do is just put a sprinkle of paprika. and a little bit of salt and a little bit of pepper. You don't have to, I like to add it. And then you wanna remove it from the heat and then you wanna make your eggs Benedict. That's ready. So thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification for my next video.